How many chasers are left? Tell me! You didn't say please. Don't play games with me, duckling! Tell me! Fine, be that way. Shah! Where's that blasted snake mount? I guess we'll have to do this the hard way! I can do this all day! What is this hideous creature? Stay back! Oh no! The duck man comes with me! I'm not gonna let you eat him! What? What the? <laughs> Too easy. Whoa, that was a close one. Thank you, Miss, um... Uh... Lilac. Miss Lilac. Are you okay? I saw a huge explosion back there. You've been following me this whole time, haven't you? Duh. I take it you know this guy. Girl. This girl? She's like my tail, always right behind me. Carol the Wildcat, at your service. And this is Lilac. Well, I'm Tork. I'm a shell duck. Shell duck? It's more of a nickname. I'm not exactly from around here. So what are you doing out here? The skies haven't been safe for days. Someone is about to steal the Kingdom Stone, and I have to stop them! The Kingdom Stone? That's impossible! Yeah, only I could steal it. You wish. Well, it's already happening. Marizawa's sending troops in disguise to the ancient temple. I have to warn them! Carol and I are pretty fast. We could run over there for you. Seriously? Yup, I've got a motorcycle, and she's a dragon. They're, like, super fast. Turn straight. Well, it's worth a shot. Hurry over there before it's too late. What about you? I'll catch up with you as soon as I find all my stuff. Right. Come on, Carol. General Gong! You two again? It's nice to see you, too. We have to talk to you. The Kingdom Stone is in danger. Don't be ridiculous. Nothing gets past my nose. Will you just listen for a minute? What is the meaning of this? We mean no disrespect. We're just you trying to... You heard that the general said? There's nothing to worry about. But... but... Don't make me repeat myself. Well, they sound like they know what they're doing. Why don't we just charge up and go home, huh? What do you say? Mm, I don't know. I feel like they're hiding something from us. It's an ambush! Follow me!
stone. So, I needed to find my father's killer. Not like a couple traitors like yourselves would care. I'd rather be called a traitor than a murderer. The scars left us no choice. And you've left me no choice. <laughs> Still training, I see. You want to fight? Come and get it. I'd love to stay and dance, but Mayor Zhao's got a tight schedule. Besides, if something else is guarding this thing, I'd hate to be around when it wakes up. You're insane, you know that? You're never gonna get away with it. <laughs> we'll see about that. Ow! He'll never make it out. But we should. Come on! Just a scratch. I'm fine. Well, we better find Torque and get home so I can patch it up. Well, this stinks. How are we gonna get more money? We'll think of something. What I really want to know is why Spade is working for Mayor Zhao. Mm, but loads of cash? Well, Zhao might know something about the assassination, but that still doesn't explain what he needs the stone for. <sighs> I have a bad feeling about all this. What? Someone's following us. What do you mean? Yeah! Ah! Wait, someone with a shield pulled me out of the cave. It must have been her. <laughs> sorry about pouncing on ya. Hello? I'm sorry? Don't be scared. I promise we'll keep you safe. 
dragon? Yeah. Can... Can I touch your hair? Huh? Oh, okay, never mind. No, no, it's okay. I was just surprised is all. Go ahead. I won't hurt you. <laughs> it's like a rope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Maybe we can be friends. Sure. I'm Mila. What's your name? Lilac. That's a pretty name. <laughs> thanks. This is my friend Carol. Hi. So, thanks for saving me back there. But what are you doing all the way out here? I was playing over here, and then those people came. They're not very nice. I'll say. You know what? You can come to our secret hideout. What? <gasps> really? Yeah. Nobody knows where it is except us. That sounds like fun! The Kingdom Stone has been taken! Your Excellency! By who? Mayor Zhao! His pilgrimage to the temple was a cover-up! This is troubling. Zhao may be a buffoon, but I never believed he was capable of this. A pair of youngsters warned us about the attack! I... Refuse to listen. I have failed you, Magister. Don't be hard on yourself, General. I would have been just as skeptical. Tell me, who was it that issued this warning? Something doesn't smell right. Well, sorry! You never smell right. I'm referring to those kids. They know something about this. We have to find them. <laughs> You sure you don't want to hang out with us? Thanks, but I have a lot of work to do. I'm gonna try and fix my gadgets. Fair enough. Just shout if you need anything. Alright. What are you gonna be up to? Oh, we should have plenty of things to do. Especially with a new girl around. I'm bored. How about a movie? Sure! Mm, why not? What kind of movies do you like, Mila? being surprised. All right, I think I have just the thing. Hey, I got to save Avalon. You're absolutely right, fellow protector. There is only one thing we can do. George doesn't want to hang out with us. He said he had some work to do. Eh, he's probably just scared of getting cooties. Cooties! <laughs> <laughs> Not like a couple traitors like yourselves would care. Lilac! Lilac! Curtis. Torxa! I mean, I went down there and, and he's... Mm, I mean... Calm he's... down, what is it? Tork turned into an alien or something! What? Just come with me, come on! <sighs> I probably had a bad dream. I'm serious, get up! Come on, get up, get All up! Alright, let me get my shoes on! Tork? <laughs> it's not what it looks like! What are you? Give us answers, buddy! Okay, okay, I'll tell you. But you have to promise to keep it to yourselves. We promise. Right, Carol? Mm, right. Pinky swear. <sighs> Alright, take a seat. I'm from another world. Actually, I'm part of an alliance between many different worlds. We're called Chasers. So you're an alien, then? Pretty much, yeah. Space cooties! <laughs> you don't believe me. Actually, I do. Really? They say that a long time ago, dragons came to Avalis and mixed with our ancestors. 
And not just ones like Lilac, huge ones like in the movies. So I guess it's not much of a stretch for other things to be out there too. I see. So why do a bunch of aliens care about our planet? The man that wants your kingdom stone isn't from around here either. He calls himself Lord Brevin. Lord? Well, he didn't get that name selling cookies. He's dangerous with a capital D. Brevin is the most powerful enemy we've ever faced. Hundreds of worlds destroyed. Thousands of heroes killed or corrupted. Enormous amounts of weapon energy stolen. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. According to our scans, the Kingdom Stone has enough energy to double the size of his army. If he gets it, he'll be unstoppable. I'll try and convince your leaders of his existence, but if I can't get them to help me, if Brevin gets his hands on the Kingdom Stone, then I'll have no choice. I'll have to destroy it. Destroy, destroy it? it? You can't be serious! I'll only destroy it if I have no other choice. I swore to my captain on his dying breath that I would not let Brevin get that stone. I'm sorry about your captain, but you can't destroy it. In fact, you won't even have to think about it because I'm going to help you get it back. I don't care how dangerous it is. It's going to take a lot more than robots and aliens to slow a dragon down. If she's going to go for it, then I am too. If we can beat up a giant praying mantis thing together, then who knows what else we can do. I want to come too! I guess we could let you save Carol's life a few more times. Hey! Yay! So the three of you are really going to help me stop him? Say no more, Team Lilac's got your back! We'll talk about the name later, okay? I'd be lying if I said I was comfortable with this, but I honestly could use your help. You all know this world better than I do. So, it's official, right? <laughs> More or less. Welcome aboard, ladies. Yes! Awesome! Wonderful! Just remember something really important. Don't talk about our mission unless I say so. We do not want the whole world thinking we're crazy. Understood. Uh-oh. I don't know about you guys, but I'm exhausted. Yeah, we better get some shut-eye. We've got a big day ahead of us. Good evening, sir. It may interest you to know that the location of the artifact has shifted. Where? It's moving toward a densely populated region to the east. This could work to our advantage. Get me the king's son. Where do your duties lie, prince? It is my duty to protect my father's kingdom. You would sacrifice your very life for the good of this kingdom, wouldn't you? Yes. And you would crush all those who threaten its safety. We must protect it at all costs. Exactly. The one you call Zhao has taken something very precious. Something that could put your kingdom at risk. You're not going to let him keep it, are you? Revenge is upon us, my fellow kin. We have confirmed who is responsible for the death of our king. Zhao of Shangmu! His plans to steal our kingdom stone must be stopped! Deploy your sky battalion! Hey, up and at him! We've got adventuring to do! Oh, five more minutes... I was wondering when you'd be awake. You can blame Carol for that. She sleeps for like half a day. <sighs> totally worth it. Well, anyway, I got a call from that big panda guy I told you about. He's gonna help us. When is he coming? Actually, we have to go meet him. He'll be waiting for us north of here. Perfect. 
I fixed my radar last night so we can use it to find the meeting point. Great! Ready, girls? Aye, aye, Captain. To adventure! According to the radar, we seem to be at the right location. Um, I think it's a little off. This way! She's got a good nose. I'll say. Allow me to properly introduce myself. I am General Gong of Shang Tu. It's an honor, General. The Royal Magister has a proposal. We'd like you to help us get the stone back. It's in the greedy little hands of Man Xiao in our neighbor city, Shang Mu. Why do you need our help? Don't you have soldiers and spies and stuff? We want to try and resolve this thing peacefully if we can, so we're sending a neutral party to negotiate. Given the, uh, current state of affairs in Shui Gong, they're out of the picture. So you need us to fly to Shang Mu and convince Zhao to give the stone back? Precisely! Let's give it a shot! Right, I assume we'll be taking one of these planes. Uh-huh, you do know how to fly it. Of course I do. <laughs> Good, when you get there, head straight for the city hall. Y yes sir! Quack. Hope you're not afraid of heights. I'll be okay.